الحمد لله رب العالمين الرحمن الرحيم مالك يوم الدين إياك نعبد وإياك نستعين اهدنا الصراط المستقيم صراط الذين أنعمت أعوذ بالله من الشيطان الرجيم بسم الله الرحمن الرحيم الحمد لله رب العالمين الصلاة والسلام على رسول الله السلام عليكم dear brothers and sisters in Islam it is an honor and privilege to appeal to you regarding an international conference which will be held in January 14 and 15 in Atlanta Georgia as you may know it will be an opportunity to address very important issues in Islam mostly when the religion is all today attack from different part and different people and this will be an opportunity to address the issues so that people will know the real message of Islam which is an uncorrupt message Islam a religion of peace Muslims living in peace and giving peace to the others it will be also an opportunity to show the diversity of islam and we are very happy if you see the panelists they from different parts of the world let it be from africa and from different part of the united states but all of them will have only one source which is the Quran and the Sunnah of the Prophet. And uh, all the issues which we will address will be solely based on the teachings of Quran and the Sunnah of the Prophet. And uh, as you may know, Sheikh Tijan Ali Yusise, the chief imam of the Masjid in Medina Kaulak, will be attending the conference with a very important delegation of scholars coming from Africa. And they'll convene in Atlanta, meeting with scholars from America. And uh, that will be one occasion for the Muslim Ummah to tell the non-Muslim community what really Islam stands for and what is really Islam. Because nowadays, throughout the media, throughout the internet, people have a tendency to get false information regarding the religion of Islam. Therefore, it is very important for Muslims to get together and tell the world the real message of the Prophet Muhammad Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam which is a message of peace, which is a message of knowledge, which is a message of improving the conditions of living on human beings on earth. Therefore, we are seizing this opportunity to call upon all our brothers to do the maximum in order to attend that conference which will be held, as I said earlier, on January 14 and 15 in Atlanta, Georgia, inshallah that will give us an opportunity as brothers and sisters in the faith of Islam to meet, to exchange views and ideas and to really focus on fighting Islamophobia in the beginning of this new millennium. Because if people don't get the real message then they might be misinformed and then they might classify Islam in a position which Islam is far away of. But if Muslim scholars, as Sheikh Matijan Sise from Kaulak or others from the United States of America get together, brothers and sisters, and deliver a crystal clear message of Islam, I think that will help to know to, to show people that Islam is a religion of peace 
and don't have nothing to do with terrorism or terrorist because even the word Islam means peace and Muslims are people who should live in peace and give peace as our beloved Sheikh, Sheikh Hassan Ali Sisi used to teach us that the best among you at the presence of Allah is the one who fear Allah the most. And fearing Allah means to do what Allah asks us to do and to stop wherever Allah asks us to stop. Therefore, when you know that Islam prevents you as a human being to take your own life, let alone to take the life of an innocent person. And that is why it is very important for all of us, as I said, to do our best in order to attend the conference, to show the power of Islam, but also to be able to explain to the others who don't know what really Islam stands for. Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh. We have to unite. We have to unite. We have to unite. We have to unite. We need your leadership. Ya kanastain. Ihdina sirat al mustaqim, sirat al ladina anamta alayhim. Ghayri al maghdub alayhim wa Oh, Lee.